It was roundly criticized the first time around, but says since then the bugs have been worked out, or so they say. And today, with a sign-up deadline looming, the head of Minnesota's Minsure program made a stop in Austin. ABC 6 News reporter Dan Conrad was there. Health insurance, insurance in general, is a very complicated subject. And when Minsure CEO Allison O'Toole visited Austin Monday, the goal was to make it less complicated. You really have to be an active consumer in a year like this. Minsure is the state-based health insurance marketplace. In a year where we're seeing inc uh, premiums increase so much. And we like to know that our families, friends, and neighbors can find affordable health insurance coverage. When we buy a new TV, we look at price, and price really is the factor that drives us. It might work for TVs, but not necessarily for health insurance. Consider the case of one woman whose husband ran up big medical bills not long after they signed up for a plan. And they didn't realize until after tens of thousands of dollars of bills that they had essentially fired Mayo as a provider. Doing the math back and forth, okay, premium's low, but I utilize more, so which was going to be the best in the end? Networks are really an important thing to research. Oh, but you have to have health insurance. We all do, now that it's the law. We are two weeks out from our first deadline. People that want to make sure their insurance is in effect January 1st need to have a plan selected and enrolled by the 15th. In its first open enrollment period, Minsure was plagued by major technical problems. We have, um, you know, no technical problems. We have high call volume. And it's worth noting that our call wait time is about 90 seconds on average. Dan Conrad, ABC 6 News.